In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the website Photobabble. You will have to do a few Photobabble assignments as speaking homework assignments. It's a very simple website to use. First, you go to photobabble.com. You can Google this to find it. Once you go to the website, if you've never created an account, then you need to sign up. If you already have an account, like me, you can sign in. When you sign in, you'll notice that you can connect with Facebook. If you have a Facebook account, it's very easy just to sign in with Facebook. It makes it a lot easier. Uh, you don't have to, though. If you don't want to sign in with Facebook, that's your choice. Absolutely up to you. I'm going to sign in with my username and password. Okay, now you can see all of the photo babbles that I've already created. When you want to make a new photo babble, you press the Create New button. Now it gives you a few options. You can upload a photo from your computer. If you're signed into Facebook, you can upload a photo from Facebook. This makes it very, very easy. I'm going to upload a photo from my computer. So if I go here, this is the photo I want to upload. I press Create. Now, if you look down here, you can see there's the picture that I'm going to talk about for my photo babble. Okay? You can change the title if you want to, do whatever you want. You also have the option to make your photo babble public or private. If you make it public, that means that anybody can see it. If you make it private, that means that only some people can see it. It's up to you what you want to do. Now, when you're ready, to make your recording, you go up here. You may have to allow Adobe Flash Player settings. Then you press record. When you press record, you can see that it's recording your voice. So this is when you start talking about the picture. This is my picture. It's a picture of my computer screen. I was looking up a website. You say whatever you need to. If you don't like it, you can always stop and you can record again. If you do like it, you can press play just to make sure. When you press record, you can see that it's recording your voice. So this is Okay, I like it. That's my voice. It sounds good. Everything's fine. Okay, at this point, all I have to do is press save. Now I've saved my photo babble. Now I'm going to share it. There are many different ways to share your photo babble. You can share it on Facebook if you want to. If you really like it, you could share it with your friends. You can copy this link to your photo babble. But I want you to share your photo babble by embedding the photo babble. This is what we're going to do. Okay? So all you do is you click on this code and then you right click and you copy it. You're going to copy the code. Then you're going to go to blogger.com and you're going to go to your blog. So find your blog and you're going to press new post. You can call your post whatever you want to, like my photo babble. Notice here you have two options for your post, compose or HTML you're going to choose HTML. It is very important that you choose HTML. If you don't press HTML, it's not going to work. First thing, press HTML. Then, right click and press paste. Now it looks crazy, lots of letters and numbers, but when you press publish, you'll see that it looks right. Okay, we're not going to share on Google+, but we're going to go to View Blog. And when we do, look, there's my photo babble. I can play it from here. When you press record, you can... Perfect. Very easy, right?